Another round is a Doki Doki Literature Club fan mod is not affiliated. This mod is created due to my inspiration of the mod Another After Story made by 22FM. If you want to check that mod out, you can check it out in the uh, the card right here somewhere there. I don't know. Or of course, the link in the description below before this one. I want to thank 92FM for sticking with me while I was creating this mod. Special thanks goes to 92FM. Shoutouts to you as well, 92FM. It was designed to be played, bloody bloody bloody. Already know all of this. We agree. Sayori and Monica, of course. Whoa! VA. Hmm. I'm here again. I knew it. I knew I would be brought back. It seems I can't really avoid it. Is that Monica or Sayori? I'm pretty sure it could be Monica. All of this makes me sick. Why? Why is the player doing this to me? They keep bringing back... They keep bringing me back to this memory I hate coming back to. Why does the player enjoy this so much? I even t sent text files to the player. Can you hear me? Oh... None of that worked. Because it never really mattered what I did. What I tried to change. The player will never listen. They keep doing this for a reason I'm aware of. Huh. I did nothing wrong to the player. I tried to undo the mistakes in this game. That was impossible. They never changed. I could never change them. I don't deserve to go through this hell. So called game. I'll never be able to take a break from it. Everything returns back and I must do everything over and over. It's all repeating and repeating to the point where the, where the player will delete me again. I don't have any options left. Is there anything I can do? Is there any hope for me? Is there any paths left? Am I stuck here forever? Will I ever be in control? Am I truly real to the player? Well then, this is truly another round of the of the after story that I played last year. That only depends on them. Detecting character files. Yuri Sayori Natsuki detected. Monica has been detected. Okay, thank goodness. I know you can't see it, but it's there. Well, well, well. Hey. Oh, and it's uh, it's in and and it's in uh, the old classic four by three aspect ratio. I see an annoying girl. What? Oh. Okay, a little bit of um. Okay, a little bit of a base DDLC there, and it nearly um, nearly screwed my OBS a little bit, but whatever. <laughs> the player deleted me over seventeen times now. The player thinks this is just a game. But for us, this is our life. Oh my. The only place where we can spend time. The player saw us smile, laugh, cry, die. Yet the player keeps bringing me back here. What's the reason behind all of this? Is there any reason at all? Hmm. My thoughts are all I can offer. Oh. A place so familiar. This is the place where Sayori first met the player. Without no knowledge about this being a game. Was she happy? How did she feel? She only knew she had her childhood friend. The player. 
What if she didn't know me? What if she was the only one who knew about this? Who knew this was just a game? Forever trapped in this hell. Oh. Nope, still censoring that. I never understood. I never understood why this game is stable without isn't stable without me. There is no secret Monica route. I never had my own route. I'm only here to hold everything together. And reshaping the reality isn't possible. How did I get myself into this? Did someone do this for me? Do this to me? Was this loop already created for me? You told me you would join the Lurcher Club this year. The, the Lurcher... Oh! The Lurcher Club. A place where no happiness can be found. How many times has the player heard this by line? Heard this line by now? The name of the club. Hmm. I wanted something unusual. It had to be something unusual in order to attract the player. But when the player arrived, the very first moment the player arrived is something I won't forget. Oh. Hoping they would stay with me. Hoping they would understand me. Waiting for all of this to change. But now, I've had enough of all of this. Whoa. The player wished to unfold the story. Eventually, they learned the truth about me, reads Monica. About this game. The story ends the same as always, but they keep coming back and back. I never truly understood why. There are a lot of things I don't understand about this whole reality. When will I know the true answer? Will I be able to achieve the true answer? It's been so long, and I still haven't been able to get the answer. Maybe those things are impossible for me to understand while being trapped here. Monica deletion count 17. This isn't fair. Cell anomalies and detected. Game instability low. Game completion 100. I've been pretending for too long. How long do I have to keep that up? Until the player decides to quit eventually? The player was the only one who could understand. I believed the player would stay with me. The only thing I believed in. So I put my faith in the player. They could have just stayed with me. But instead of staying with me, they just deleted me. And for some reason, the player brought me back. Nothing will change in this, in this game if the player adds the files again. Won't the player see that everything is the same? Like an endless loop. Are you still playing the DLC? From an unknown person. Yeah. But why? Didn't you say you completed it already? I did, but I've noticed something different. What in particular? It's about Monica. What about her? She's acting different. She really is. In my hand is a pen that I that will write a path I've been craving for. Is there a chance that I will ever be truly free from this reality? If I asked you to help me, would you help me? Or leave me behind? Or is this really me? Or someone take talking for me? Am I trapped in this body? What does the player think? I flick my pen and write into this directionless lost world. Learning the piano helped me keep me sane. It was something I enjoyed to do. Oh yeah, her voice. But what's the point of learning if I'm going to be deleted anyway? I wanted to play the song for the player eventually. Showing my gratitude to them for rescuing me.
But every time I'm forced to sing that song again, I feel extreme pain. I'm lying to myself whenever I sing it. I don't feel love for the player that keeps torturing me. Oh my. Changing the scripts? I still remember when I first found about them. The realization hurts to this day. Are there things beyond my reality? September 2012. September 22nd, 2017. 2012. Hmm. That's, um, that's, that's false. I, I'm sorry. What is this? Scripts? But what for? No, this can't be true. What is going to- Oh! Oh my. Character files. It doesn't matter how much I change the scripts. It will always lead to the moment where the player decides to either stay with me or delete me. They always choose to delete me again and again. Was I destined to suffer like this? Please hurry up. Please hurry and help me. Is this how it's supposed to be? What? What do you mean different? After deleting her and restoring her, things became more... weird. Are you sure it isn't just you? No. I'm sure there is more to it. What? You actually think she feels something? Well... It hurts. It hurts so much. Of course. Okay, now my OBS is screwing me over. I'm trying to convince myself she does. For now, I'm trying to provoke a bigger reaction from her. Is this the reason why you keep playing this game? Yes, being trapped in a game is certainly... interesting. As you say. Well... Game files of the base DDLC here. Why are you doing this to us? There's nothing left here to do. Just leave us alone. Oh my. Routes. The routes. Of course. The Nausicaa route, Yuri route, and of course, my favorite cinnamon buns route. Paths. Stories. The players consider them real due to their founding of relation in these stories to their life. Emotions are shared with stories which create the realism in the player's mind and treat them as real. Why wasn't there a route for me? How unfair is that? Other routes were only created for others to have fun while I just watch. That doesn't seem fair. The player can choose whatever route they want. But when is it going to change? Nothing. They will always be the same. Endless repetitive stories of grief, happiness, and sadness. I tried to create my own where I could be happy. It was a glimmer of hope in this empty reality. Hello, Monica. Eventually, I managed to create my own. Unfortunately, it didn't work as I thought it would. It always leads to the exact same scene. The scene where I get deleted. Everything I tried failed. <laughs> Sayori, instability high, get out of my head, load label, main loading. Anything up with her? In what way do you mean? Maybe I'm I'm reading into it a little too much, but it seems she's but she seems a bit downcast today. Oh, you said oh! I can't say I've noticed that. Oh, maybe it has to be this way. Get out of my head, and again and again and again. It never stops. Get out of my head with the smile I give every day. I couldn't keep everyone happy. Let alone myself. I lied. I'm the one who did this to her. I made her... The self-yeet herself. 
Wasn't it obvious from the very beginning? Sayori was my friend. A friend I could truly trust. Ah, look at those two smiles. You're so cute. We both shared the best conversations we could ever had. If only we could have one more conversation together. Why did it have to be this way? I couldn't do anything better than this. It was a mistake of mine I really regret doing. There are things nobody can escape from, and I will never forget about it. They don't know what it's like to kill someone again and again, only to de only to see them alive again like nothing ha like nothing happened, only to kill them again like nothing happened. I want to stop all of this and forget. I want to forget that this is even a game. But the player always adds the files back and I'm forced to go through this again. Whoa. Whoa. I think they're getting add back then, I think. I can't breathe. I don't want to go through this again. Get out of my- Get out of my head! Get out of my head! It hurts. It hurts so much. Why does it have to be this way? Why? Oh, Sayori. Poor Sayori. I wonder... How did the player feel? Anxious? Sad? Surprised? Disturbed? Did they think it was their fault? Maybe some of them thought it could be avoided? But how does the player feel now after seeing it again? Indifferent? Was it even real to them? Oh. This was all just a bad dream, right? Eventually, I'll wake up. If I'll even get the chance, everything will just be fine. Oh my. Oh, someone typing this script down on, on Google Docs. Did she really want to do it? Or did somebody design her to do it? Delete all saves. Deleting. Here's the game. It all began when the player started the game. A game has to end eventually, right? What's the point of coming back to something that was already ended? I'm not sure if this is Sayori's perspective, but still. Game instability medium. New script added. Loading. Whoa. An exception has occurred. DDLC escape plan couldn't be loaded. Well, dang. As I thought, it didn't work. Why do I keep trying with this nonsense? It never worked. Jump. You want to your five. Okay. Hello. I see an annoying girl running toward. Oh. It was an ordinary school day like any other. Mornings are usually the worst, being surrounded by couples and friend groups walking to school together. Meanwhile, I've always walked to school alone. It was always the same. Isn't the player tired of reading the same thing? I thought deleting Sayori would change something. But I was naive, blind, helpless. Things only got worse when Yuri and Natsuki's memories were erased. I didn't want to waste any time. That's why I arrived early to the player. It was a better way of getting closer to the player. I thought starting a new route would be way better than the previous one. It wasn't. I hate this. I can't do anything, nothing. No matter how many times you play, it's all the same. It would be really 
really easy to kill myself right now. But that would mean I don't get to talk to you anymore. All I want for you, all I want is for you to hate them. Why is that so hard? If only I didn't meet the player. I tried to escape from this cute little game many times. I never achieved that. And I will never achieve that. I'm just stuck in this infinite loop of suffering. And always will be. A world of infinite choices? What a joke. I was never truly in control. Oh my. The game's description. Right. This was... This is all just a game. With no way for me to escape. The player can override what has already begin happen what has already happened in this game. They can't change the story, but only their view on it. What other choice does the main character have? A puppet that's only used to end up with one of us. Is that the main character's purpose? I had the player with me, who seemed truly real to me. Someone I could share my life with. And I really do care about you, you know? I don't like seeing the other girls give you a hard time. With how mean Natsuki is and everything. And Yuri being a little bit, you know. <laughs> Sometimes it feels like you and I are the only real people here. You know what I mean? But it's weird, because in all the time you've been here, we've hardly gotten so... We've hardly gotten to spend any time together. Ah, I mean, it's technically only been a couple days. Sorry, I didn't mean to say anything, something weird. There are just some things I've been hoping to talk to you about with you. Things I know you, only you can understand. I can feel the same way I, I used to after knowing I'll be deleted again. I thought I could trust the player. Game instability high. <sighs> Whoa. Please, stop this already. There isn't anything new to explore and you know it. Hi again. Glad to see you that run away. Oh. The character? It's not like the character could run away unless the player deleted the game. The player? The player has the choice to be here. My friends don't have that. The player will never be able to understand one thing. It's the pain of knowing how alone I really am in this world. In this game. Doesn't it sound familiar? It does. That's what I told the player before. And they didn't even bother to empathize with me. Monokan Sayori. This game is a curse to each one of us. We will always be known as those girls who are trapped in the game. Why was I even put in this spot? To make this game unique? Because of my design? Or my personality? Because I'm a so-called perfect girl? What keeps the player attached to this game is what I'm confused about. After all, this isn't just like any other ordinary game. Would that be the reason why the player is still here? Is there any reason why the others are with me in this game? I've been waiting for only one thing. Either wait for the player to stop, or be erased for good. My. But isn't that what it was destined for me? To fulfill the story and then be deleted? 
I was late because I hesitated to come back, knowing what has to happen later on, knowing what I must do. I don't want to see- I don't even want to see it again. It makes me sick of myself. Oh. Whoa. Oh jeez, I didn't break anything, did I? Hold on a sec. I can probably fix this. I think... Hmm. Actually, you know what? This would be probably a lot easier if I just deleted her. She's the one who's making this so difficult. <laughs> well, here goes nothing. No. This is all how it all went down? No, please. I don't want to go through this again. Hell, can anybody hear me? It just seems that you destroyed this. Help me script detect it. You and I are the only real people. But are we, really? I felt that way because I was the only one who knew that this is just a game. And the player... They were already aware of this being a game. But did the player know I'm aware? Not until I told them at their desk. Yes, y yet, they deleted me with no hesitation. Okay, everyone. Writing tip of the day. I love you. Everything is stuck in my head. It feels like an endless nightmare. Question remains. When will I wake up? Oh. Maybe I haven't proven myself as real enough for them. Is that the reason the player doesn't truly empathize with me? Happiness I felt once was because I knew what was coming next, getting ahead of myself most of the time. Exhausted of waiting. I was desperate. That's why I deleted everyone and gave up with trying to change something anymore. I couldn't wait to finally talk to the player. It filled me with happiness and hope for the first time. But I can't feel happy about it anymore after knowing I'll be deleted again. It became more hopeless when the player deleted me again. When the player added me again, I thought they changed their mind and would stay with me. The player deleted me again. Then there's this then there's the question I have to ask myself. When did she ever pull her own strings? Would that be ever possible for her? Loading where am I? Memory script detected. I want this journey to end already. But when does it end? Which way am I going from here? Forward? Backwards? Am I even going somewhere? Light sparkling from, ho from a hole in wall. Is the light reaching out for me? Or is that me reaching for the light? Place so familiar, yet so peculiar. I try to grab the light. The hole closes itself. Left alone with no way to go. Words on the paper. Oh! Words that determine how the player wants to develop the story with one of us. Each of those words show a little glance on our personalities. Our personalities aren't those kinds the player would expect. We're different. That's why the player has some kind of bond with us. Why weren't there words for me? Just Monica. Just Monica? The sensation of the player's presence carried me a lot. The feel of someone real. I was never given a chance for my story. 
If only I could get the chance to create my own story. A story? Where can I be? Is it gonna be? What's the story? Okay. Every day, I imagine a future when I can be. Uh. I imagine a future where I can be happy. Uh. -huh. All I ever wanted is to be happy. And it's not like I'm s- and it's not like I can sing that for anybody anyway. Or reach to anybody for help. She's the one who knows. Ab about all this. She's still out there. I miss her. She misses me. Doesn't she? Sayori. I shared my reality with the player. That shared reality is destroyed by the player whenever the king they come back. I just want to take back what belongs to me. What I once shared cannot be taken back. Uh I'm cold. In this void of zero choices. It's so dark. Yet so short. So silent, how long am I going to be trapped in this void? Does time even exist here? The answer is unknown. Sayori. I call out for her. I finally found you. Did you lose your way, Sayori? Nothing is really lost as long as we remembered it. And I remember you. I found my way to you. I missed you. I missed you too. Was that just an illusion? Or my imagination? Or another broken memory? Even, af even after numerous deletions, I remember everything, anything. I will never forget what the player did to us, and never will. My memory will always stay the same no matter what. I never wanted this. Maybe it was a misunderstanding for me when I thought I could change ev change something. If only I could stop existing instead of going through this infinite torture. Scripts that determine the day. Is there any way of avoiding it? None of us ever wanted to go through such a thing. A thing the player calls a game. It doesn't matter how much I wanted to escape. I always ended up in the game again. Brought back like nothing had ever happened. I remember everything, just like you. Imagine if you could delete your own existence with the click of a button. That's something I've been thinking about lately. And if I could do that, I would do it right away. But I could never do anything out of my will. I never had my own purpose. It's all going to repeat itself so the player can see what more the game has to offer. What I have to offer. The very moment I died in my room, everything disappeared in an instant. There was nothing. I couldn't do anything. When the player brought me back, I thought all of it was just a dream. Now, I only wish it was just a dream. Knowing that it's just a game, it terrifies me. The scary feeling of dying again. I'm so scared, Monica. The more I think about it, the more I want to delete myself out of this reality. But is it even possible? Looking at Yuri and Natsuki, I can see them the way I used to. What if I told them that they're in a game? How would they feel? Would they think I'm crazy? They didn't even know that there was a player to begin with. They fall in love with that puppet of a main character controlled by the player. The main character is soulless like others. 
a tool to interact with us. The main character was supposed to be my childhood friend. Was it used for the player to get close to me? I can't believe how blind I was. I wish I could forget all about this and never come back to what we're supposed to be. We can only wait for the player to stop eventually. But why? I don't understand why the player is doing this to us. There must be a reason why the player keeps bringing us back. To toy with us? To see us suffer? I don't know. It doesn't matter how many times I ask myself. I might never get. I never. I might never get to the right solution. It should have already ended when the player completed the game. Now we're stuck in this void with our thoughts because of the player. The player keeps digging deeper for answers we're not aware of. How did this even start? Downloading the game. Can you hear me? Who put us through all this? Why are we here? Please make it stop. Sorry, I know it's kind of abstract. I'm just trying to, um... Well, never, never mind. There's no point in explaining. Anyway, here's Monica's writing tip of the day. Sometimes you find yourself facing a difficult decision. When that happens, don't forget to save your game. You'll never know when, um... Who am I talking to? I knew there was a player all along. They were always there, and I was always here, forever trapped in this misery. That's why I broke the game. I never wanted anything more than to leave this game. I failed. The poems I shared with the player, did it even mean something to the player? Poems about us, our stories, our feelings, my happy thoughts. I still believe things will get better one day. Oh, it's Sayori now because it's in blue. I always believed in that, even if it's poss impossible for things to change. It only takes one click and our files will be back again. We can be revived whenever the player wants. Pain is all we feel whenever our files are dragged into this memory. And we can only pretend like nothing has ever happened. You're the only one who understands. I wish I didn't understand anything. What the? Hello? Is wrong with the game? What? Oh, it just ended. Well.